Hello, it's Richard. Yeah, Mr. Mr. Richard, this is the call from Microsoft once again. Oh, yes. So you do one thing, you go in front of your computer right now. Yes, I am. Okay, the computer is on? Yes, the computer is on. Okay, and sir, what can you see? I see my uh, Facebook page. You do one thing, you minimize your Facebook. First of all, you minimize it. Minimize it? Minimize it. Okay. Yes, I did. Now, uh, press the four flag window key and the letter R, okay? With one or two finger? Yeah, with two finger, four flag and the letter R. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. What can you see now? Event VVR. Uh, yeah, event VWR. Press enter. Okay. This event V as in Victoria, W as in Whiskey, or R like Russia, okay? Huh? Okay. What, what, what? It's like event VWR. Yeah, I have pushed enter. I'm now in the lo uh, logbook. Okay, you are in the log book. Yeah, Can you see any option like uh, Windows log book? I have a guy, huh? after, after watching. In the left hand side, can you see any option like Windows log book? Uh, yes, I see it. Give a double click on Windows log book. Are you sure? Is that not dangerous? No, 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 it is not dangerous. I am only going to show you the program. Oh, okay. oh. The computer is facing, okay? Oh, wait. Yes. Uh... And sir, if you don't mind me asking you that, how old are you? I'm 36. 36? Okay. Yes. How old are you? I am 32 years old. 32? 32. 32. Oh, 32. 32, yes. <laughs> now, sir, can you see any option like two passing? Two passing, uh, yeah. What, double click on two passing? Uh, what oh, can you see? Oh, wait, wait. Uh, uh, two passing, yes. Sorry? What I see now? Can you see lots of information, information, information? Can you see that? Yeah, information, fault, information, information, yeah. fault. This was the problem which your computer is facing and I was talking about, sir. What, what is the, the thing, sir. What, what does, what, what is the problem with it? This is the term corrupted malicious jump files. This is trying to corrupt your Windows hard disk. Windows operating system, okay? Okay, that's not good. Now, sir, do one thing, you close it. Uh, how is it, how, how did I uh, make uh, the errors? How did I do that? You cannot do it by yourself. You need the help of Microsoft. I'm telling you how to do it, okay? Must, I call, it must I call Microsoft now? What? Must I call Microsoft? This is only the Microsoft, sir. I will help you. Oh, you are for Microsoft. The headquarter of, this is the headquarter of Microsoft, okay? This is from USA, California. Okay. Now you close the logbook in. And what was your name? Close the logbook and close yeah, it. Yes, I already did. But what was your name? My name is David Smith. David? Smith. Smith. Uh, uh, I'm looking you up on the Facebook, okay? Yeah. Now, sir, David you Smith. Have a, do, you have a Google, do you have a Google Chrome? No, I have uh, on the Internet Explorer. Turn on the Internet Explorer. Yes, I'm on Facebook now. But... Uh, no. I was looking for you, for David Smith. Oh, oh you are looking for me, okay. <laughs> yeah, to be friends on Facebook. <laughs> okay, no problem. Uh, you confirm me your email address, I will send you a friend request, but later on. Oh. Now, sir, open a new fresh tab, okay? We need to give a service to your computer. Oh, yeah. Open a new fresh tab, okay? Yes. I opened it. Well, you type over there. W, 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 three times W www dot, a dot yes and right over there a a like america a m m like microsoft microsoft yes i already did 
Once again, M. M like Microsoft. And then Amy? Amy? Com. Amy? Yeah. Amy dot com. Amy dot com. What can you see now? Uh, I have to watch uh, Amy. Zero config remote desktop service Amy admin. The easiest way to establish remote desktop give connection. Click on, yeah, give a click on that. Give a click on that. You can easily share a remote desktop or control a server over the internet with Amy admin. No matter where you are, Amy admin makes it safe and easy to quickly access remote desktops within a few seconds. Uh, Amy admin is used by more than. 36 million personal and corporate users. Whoa, that's a lot, eh? Yeah. It's a remote the desktop color connection color? becomes easy with Amy Admin. Attention, please read this before you giving unknown people access to your computer. Oh, I must read something. Sir, you do one thing. Yeah. In the right hand side of the page, can you see there is so many flags? Yeah. Give a click on the German flag. Give a click on the German flag. German? I'm Dutch. Yeah, do just uh, give a click on German flag. Okay. Remote desktop okay, verbinding yeah. and the fan one to einfach. In the middle, in the middle of the page, can you see there is a green color rectangular box? It is written like Amy admin start and cost and loss. Can you see that? Yeah, but I I switch back to the English because I can't read it. Please okay, and in the middle of the page, can you see there is a little like start working with ME admin three? Can you see that? Sorry? In the middle of the page, there is a small green color box. Yeah. It is I written see. like, yeah, give a double click on that. It is written like start working with ME admin three. Can you see that? Yeah, but I must uh, read uh, this. It says, uh, dear use of ME admin, unfortunately, there are some cases of malicious. Uh, if you receive phone call claiming to be from Microsoft or someone claiming to work on their behalf telling you that you have fears on your computer, some errors which they will help you fix with Amy Admin, it's definitely a scam. Uh, uh? There also might be phone calls from people pres presenting themselves as internet service provider technicians or other tech support specialists. Yeah, something. Mm. They yeah, say this, is AMI, this is the AMI page created by the Microsoft. Sorry? The, this is the AMI page created by the Microsoft to prevent the anti hacking department. Yeah, but they say uh, the, uh, if you receive a phone call claiming to be Microsoft or someone yeah, claiming to work. Yeah, yeah, I know that because the owner of the Microsoft has uh, created this page and they have given this warning alert so that any other people who used to claim in the name of Microsoft. They cannot give you the proof. They are a scam. Okay, but I am calling you from Microsoft. I can give a proof of that. Okay, uh, I can make you go to the official website of Microsoft, which is uh, providing the support to your computer through this website. Okay. Yeah, but how I am sure that you are from Microsoft? I can uh, tell you the license ID of your computer. This license ID is only with the Microsoft. Okay. And with the help of this ME admin, I will make you go to the website of Microsoft, which cannot a normal person cannot do that because login to the Microsoft website is only can be done by the Microsoft technician. Okay. Yeah, but I have to first download the program, and then yeah, give, then you yeah, yeah, give then a, you are in my system. I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give a double click on that. Give a double click on that. No, I don't know. I don't think I want to do it. I will prove myself. You don't have to worry for that, sir. I've, with this, uh, with this, uh, with this uh, website, you will be connected to the Microsoft, okay? It's and I will make you in the Netherlands. Yeah, I know that. And I will make you go to the official website of Microsoft because we have given that warning alert so that any other people who used to claim in the name of claiming to be in the name of Microsoft, they cannot go access to your computer. Uh, I'm so scared so, to, uh, to download something because I never don't download. Have to worry. You don't programs. be. Don't be don't be scared. I will make you go to the official website of Microsoft to show you the problems because I have shown you that warning alert that Maybe your computer I, is setting up out and the information, information. I, I have shown you that. Yeah, but maybe I go back to the 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 the, the shop who, uh, where I bought the computer.
They can fix no, it, man. Uh, no, it's that is a very wrong shop. concept. Your local shop cannot help you. If you oh. go to them, they will, they will ask you for a money, but they cannot solve the problem. And you don't ask the money for, for repairing my computer problem. But they cannot solve this problem because this is not the uh, this is not a hardware pro problem. This is the problem inside your software. Yeah. It can only be done by the Windows because you are running a computer with the Windows operating system. Maybe maybe I go to to format my po uh, PC. Then I have no problems anymore. I think. No, to, no. To reinstall in the Windows, world maybe except, that's a better idea. No specialist in the whole world except no. Microsoft. Yeah. Can help you. Okay. Yeah. What does it cost me? No, no, it don't cost you anything. And nothing it's is for free in this world. Nothing Not everything you have to pay I... in this world. Yeah, that also I know that. Nothing is free in this no, world. No, only uh, this service. No, uh, I never heard of free service. I know that nothing is free in this world, sir. See? But Microsoft is free service checkup call. Because we don't want to lose the customers like you. Sorry? Oh? Sorry? I have said to you that, yeah, you are absolutely right that nothing in this world is free, but Microsoft is providing you a free service checkup call. Ah. You don't have to worry for that. You will not be charged a single amount of money for the services we are going to provide up to your computer. Okay? Hmm. Now, give a double click on AMI admin start in cost and loss. Start working with AMI admin. Give a double click on that. But... It's not it's a kind of scamming thing. No, 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 no. You are wrong, sir. Oh, because no, you are wrong. It's it's get the, the the Amy page gives a warning of it. This is a page created you can read by the, that on the the Microsoft owner has created uh, the scientist of this uh, page. The scientist who has created who has invented this page. He has given this warning alert because many people can say that they are calling from Microsoft, but they cannot prove themselves. Here, here, are are some, there are also some cases on the page. Here, here, here one says, here are some cases on the scam. I got a call from an Indian, India-based consulate who said to me that he's calling from a government organization in Melbourne, uh, Australia. He made me, uh, me to log into my computer to track some files and without advising me, he wanted me to download... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. I understand your concern. They are not the true callers. They are a fake person. You know that, sir? Sorry? They are, they are a fake person. They are going to enter inside your computer for them only. Yeah, Microsoft, they... for them, for that caller, the Microsoft has given this attention warning. So that you cannot give the access to your computer to any person you don't know about it, okay? But do I need to credit card? Yeah. Yeah, you... for your safe and security. For a credit card? For your safe and security, this warning alert has been given to your computer that yeah. you cannot give access to any person without your prime knowledge. But uh, and uh, another one said I was uh, recently called by what I thought was my internet service provider technician who used Amy to gain remote access to my computer. After I uh, stupidly granted him that permission, it, it turns out that he was nothing to do with my internet service provider. When I became uh, yeah. suspicious and began okay. questioning him, he said he would show me who he was and opened a website of a company. The website uh, triggered my virus software and I then demanded that the remote access be terminated. Yeah, okay, no problem. And in our case, you we will not go to your phone. So that's why I think from more, well, uh, should I uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. do it? I know that, I know that. I, I completely it? understand your concept. You are yeah, everybody's right. scared today in the, today yeah, for yeah, viruses yeah, yeah. and hackers. Case, and yeah, but in this case, we are not going to enter inside your personal documents. With this, uh, with this website, we were going to remove the error and the warning messages from your computer. I, I will go back to the 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 uh, Windows and the R with uh, you know with the uh, uitvoeren box. Windows logbooks uh, toepassing. Can I not delete uh, to the errors myself? Yeah, you cannot delete the errors by yourself. That is the reason Microsoft has said to you. Oh, okay. That is the reason Microsoft is calling you because no specialist in the whole world. Except the Microsoft can help you. But you know that it's my computer, so can you give me my uh, IP address? 
Yeah, your IP address is 192.168.1.9. Oh, wait a minute, huh? I have to find my... I, one minute, I have to check it. Uh, uh, and when I can tell you the computer license ID of your computer, which proves that I'm calling you from Microsoft. What, what, what was my uh, IP address you said? I can even tell the license ID. Can you do one thing? You push down the four flag window and the letter R. Once again, you push down the four flag and the letter R. Go to the authorization box. Yeah. Yeah, I did. Remove, remove the event viewer from there. Remo remove event viewer. Type over there, C, C like computer. Yeah. Then M, M like Microsoft. Yeah. Then D, D like doctor. Yeah. Press enter now. Huh? Press enter now. I have to push M and D. Yeah, it's no, no, no. It's like CMD. C like computer. Oh, yeah. M like yeah, CMD. Yeah. I did it. Can you see a black window? Yeah, it's a DOS. Yeah. And just beside your username, can you see there is a small cursor blinking over there? Yeah, I see. Type over there A. A like America. Yeah. S like Switzerland. Yeah. Once again, S like Switzerland. Yeah. O like Oscar or uh, Obama. Yeah. Then C like computer. Yeah. Press enter now. Nah, I'm scared. <laughs> I don't uh, dare it. But uh, do you know my, my host name? Can you tell me my host name? Which um, internet provider I'm using? No, I don't know about the internet provider because sir, I'm giving you an example. If your baby is suffering from any type of disease, you will take your baby to a doctor. The doctor will not ask the name of your baby. The doctor will ask what's the problem your baby is facing right now. Yeah. In the same case, it is right here. If you press the enter, I will show you the computer software license ID of your computer. I will tell it from my side. You match it from your side so that you can trust that I'm calling you from Microsoft, okay? Uh, I don't, uh, I, I, I am scared to press enter, so I won't uh, push the enter button. Yeah, you know, push enter. No, I don't push enter, no. I don't know I what, uh, what kind of, uh, uh, what kind of, uh, what kind no, of... I, uh, it, it I will, no, no, no. I will show you the license ID of your computer. I will tell the ID from my side. You match it from your side so that you can trust that I am calling you. Yeah, but what's your telephone number so I can call you back? Give me your telephone number. I will call you back so I can see if you're from uh, Windows. Sir, this is not my private number that I can give you my number and you will call me back. This is the official dialer number of Microsoft. Yeah, but what's uh, they have a um, telephone number. What's the telephone number of Microsoft then? That I I can't. I'm not allowed to give the telephone number. It is against the rule. For your sake of computer, I don't want to lose my job. But you're calling from from where? California. Yeah, and sir, I'm trying to help you. I've shown you the problems which your computer is facing, okay? And mm -hmm. with this ASSOC as such, you press enter, I will show you the license ID of your computer. This license ID represents that we are calling you from Microsoft because when you purchase your computer at that time, your name, your address, your telephone number, everything is registered to the Windows. And I will tell this ID from my side, you match it from your side, so that you can yeah. trust this call, okay? So press enter from your keyboard. No, I am scared. Don't be scared, don't be scared. Yeah, I'm so scared I, I will... to, to push the button, you know? Because I uh, sit with no, all my uh, banking accounts and things like that on my PC. No, 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 no. I'm not going to check your banking account, so try to understand. This is so, Microsoft. This is not a matter of a joke. Yeah. But I've got so much warnings from the oh, from the internet of uh, scammers. Sir, you're not trying to understand. This is Microsoft. This is not a matter of yeah, a joke. Yeah, but you can't even give me a telephone number of Microsoft. 
this is a professional call, sir. This is a professional call. Yeah, but give me, give me a, a, a phone number of the head. You know, wait a moment. Just a moment, sir. In the Netherlands. A moment. I will do one thing, sir. I will first make you go to the official website of Microsoft, okay? I will first go make you go to the official Microsoft, uh, website of Microsoft. You open your Internet Explorer. Yeah. I, it's opened. Okay, now type over there www. Yeah. Then give a dot, give a single point. Yeah. Then write down M like Microsoft. Yeah. I like Indigo. Yeah. C like computer. Yeah. And li write over there Microsoft. Write over there Microsoft. Yeah. The full spelling of Microsoft. Yeah. Give a dot. Yeah. Give a dot. Yeah. Then write over there S. S like Switzerland. Switzerland? S like Switzerland, yeah. Right over there, www.microsoft.support. S U P P O R T, support. Yeah. Then give a slash. Give a slash. Slash help. H E L P, help, okay? Yeah. Okay, and press enter. Go to this website. I get a uh, Chinese site, I get now. Yeah, can you see the website of Microsoft? Yeah, I've got now uh, the, the Dutch uh, Microsoft uh, page. Yeah, yeah. In the down, you see, sir, there is written like Log Me in Rescue. Log Me in Rescue is the official partner of Microsoft. See over there, there is written like that. Mm, I have to find it, huh? Yeah, you find, you try to find it. It is in the down. It is in the bottom of the page. You try to find. It is written something like Log Me in Rescue. Uh, no. Uh, if, if I go to the, uh, I go uh, to. Uh, to uh. A moment, you you look at this website. I'm coming in two minutes, okay? Yeah, I'm look looking. Now. Website, yes, yeah. I'm looking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, read this website. Speak page. Je mag sap hebben. Geen cola. Geen cola. Cola! Hallo? Hallo, you're still here? Yeah, now open a new fresh tab. Yeah, but I didn't open. found the, the... What you say, how you say that was? Log me in rescue. Yeah, log me in rescue, maar... Uh, I didn't found it on the page. Help okay, now I will you. I will show you that we are calling you from Microsoft. Okay, you will get to receive a message from Microsoft. Now you do one thing: open a new fresh tab. Yeah. Then write over there www. Dot. www. Dot. Then write over there support s u p p o r t support. Yeah. Dot m like Microsoft, t e like Elizabeth. Support.me. M like Microsoft, E like Elizabeth, okay? Yeah. Press enter now. Huh? What? Press enter. And what can you see? Yeah, I don't know. Can you see? What can you see? Ah. Uh, understanding. What? Yeah, it says. Uh, Help a connection of it. What is written over there? Lock my rescue. See? Lock my rescue. Lock me in rescue. Okay, it is asking you for a six digit code. Lock me in rescue. Asking you for a six digit code. Can you see that? Yes. Okay, now I will provide you up with the code, okay? So that you can do it. Sorry, what, what I have to do here? It is 
trusting you for a six digit code? Yeah. I have to uh, make. Uh, yeah. Right over there, the code that is four eight five. Yeah, but then I make a connection. Yeah. I have to have to <laughs> read how it works. One moment. A client two percent for now. Copy client out. Percent. Use account account any percent now. Use right. Okay, this is uh, this is same like Amy, but then it's in a. Uh, it's also in. How you say that? It's also to make a connection with my computer. It says yeah, in Dutch. It is from the Microsoft, sir. It is from the Microsoft. Enter the six-digit code. You will see. It says enter in the six-digit code. The code will be four eight five. Yeah, but it says it's. Uh, be sure that you are only. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. You will get a message from Microsoft. Persons and organizations that you trust. Sir, you will get a message from Microsoft. Don't make me panic. Uh, yeah, but I don't. I'm not sure because it's not legit, legit team, I think. I'm so scared, you know, from the computer. Uh, sir, I sir, sir, I will get a message from Microsoft. Yeah, but I never. Uh, this is the first time I, I get the message. You continuously try to make you understand that. Sorry. I am continuously trying to make you understand that this is not a joke going on. It's not. It's not a joke. It's not uh, no. a prank call. Uh. <laughs> you enter the six-digit code now. Sorry. Ze hebben opgehouden.